We can solve applications of perimeter and circumference by using the information we know about how to find the distance around closed geometric objects. So let's see in this example how that's going to help us. So Wally wants to add a fence to the back of his house to make some room for his children to play safely. And this is a diagram of his house and then the part of the yard that he's going to fence. He started measuring, so he measured three feet this distance, five feet this distance, and 10 feet this distance. But he got distracted and had to run to the store. When he's at the store, he remembers that his house is 15 yards long. So this part of the house is 15 yards. And it looks like everything we have here is in feet. So I'm going to multiply that by 3 to get 45 feet. So this distance from here to here is 45 feet. So he wants to know how much fencing he's going to need to buy. And does he have enough information to figure that out? So if I just fill in the pieces that I know here, I'm going to draw a little marks to indicate that this is 45 feet. And I have 5 feet and three feet and ten feet. So the amount of fencing he needs is going to be five feet. So I'm going to write fencing is five plus, then he'll need ten plus five plus forty-five plus three plus another 10, plus another 3. And that is all going to be in units of feet. So if I add those together, I get 15, 20, plus 45, plus 10, plus 2 threes is 16 feet which gives me 65 feet plus 16 feet, which is 81 feet. So uh, when he's at the store, Wally should buy 81 feet of fence.